Once upon a time, there was a beautiful mermaid named Ariel who lived in the depths of the ocean with her father, King Triton, and her six sisters. Ariel had always been fascinated by the human world and longed to explore it. She would often sneak away from her underwater kingdom to watch ships passing by and dream of the day she could walk on land. One day, Ariel came across a shipwreck and found a handsome prince named Eric stranded on a piece of debris. She saved him from drowning and brought him to the shore. As Ariel watched over him, she fell in love with the prince. Determined to become human and be with Eric, Ariel made a deal with the sea witch Ursula. In exchange for Ariel's beautiful voice, Ursula would give her human legs and three days to make Eric fall in love with her. If Ariel failed, Ursula would keep Ariel's voice forever and Ariel would become one of Ursula's slaves. Ariel set off to find Eric and, with the help of her friends Flounder and Sebastian, she managed to make Eric fall in love with her. However, Ursula had other plans and used Ariel's voice to control Eric and threatened to kill him. Ariel, with the help of her father and her friends, managed to defeat Ursula and reclaim her voice. In the end, Ariel and Eric were united and lived happily ever after. Ariel became human permanently and lived with Eric on land. She bid farewell to her underwater kingdom and her loved ones, but she knew that they would always be in her heart. The story of Ariel and Eric's love is a tale of adventure and sacrifice, of longing and fulfillment. It teaches us that true love knows no boundaries and that with determination and courage, we can achieve our dreams. Ariel, who was now a human, had to learn how to adapt to her new life on land. She had to learn how to walk and talk, and how to interact with humans. Eric was patient and understanding, and he helped Ariel every step of the way. They spent every moment together and their love for each other grew stronger. As Ariel was learning about the human world, she realized that there were many problems that needed to be addressed. She saw how humans were polluting the oceans and destroying the marine life. She knew that she had to do something to help. Ariel started to work with environmental groups and organizations to raise awareness about the importance of protecting the oceans and preserving marine life. She became an advocate for ocean conservation and used her voice to speak out against pollution and overfishing. Eric was proud of Ariel's work and he supported her every step of the way. Together, they traveled the world, educating people about the importance of the oceans and encouraging them to take action to preserve them. They organized beach cleanups, campaigned for stricter fishing regulations, and promoted sustainable seafood choices. Years passed and Ariel and Eric's love for each other never wavered. They had children of their own and they raised them to be environmentally conscious and to appreciate the beauty of the oceans. Ariel's work had a positive impact on the oceans and marine life. The oceans were cleaner and the marine life was thriving. Ariel's story is a reminder that one person can make a difference and that we all have a responsibility to protect our planet. It also shows that true love can conquer all obstacles and that with love and determination, we can achieve our dreams. Years went by and Ariel and Eric grew old together, but their love never faded, they passed on their values and love for nature and ocean to next generations and they will always be remembered as the couple who fought for the ocean, they were happy and content with their life together, and they knew that they had made a difference in the world, and that their legacy would live on. Ariel and Eric's love story was not just a fairy tale, it was a true inspiration for the people around them. Many were moved by their love and determination to make a difference in the world. They were known as the ocean saviors, and people from all over the world came to hear their stories and to learn from them. As they grew older, Ariel and Eric decided to retire and spend their remaining years on a secluded island, where they could be surrounded by the beauty of the ocean. They built a small home on the island, and they spent their days swimming in the ocean, fishing, and enjoying the simple pleasures of life. Even in their old age, Ariel and Eric's love for each other never wavered. They were each other's best friend and they shared everything. They would sit on the beach and watch the sunset, holding hands and talking about their adventures and the memories they had shared. One day, Eric became ill and Ariel knew that his time was coming to an end. She stayed by his side, holding his hand and telling him how much she loved him. She promised him that she would always remember him and that their love would live on forever.